And before we even take a break, we're going to do the Donkey Kong songs. We're going to do it. And the reason we're going to do this is because I remember this being very crusty. And someone sent me a collection by season. And it says here, uh, so someone named Leo sent me this. Everyone knows Donkey Kong Country has fantastic music. But what a lot of people don't know, this also applies to pretty much anything Donkey Kong related. Okay. In the late 90s, a cartoon was made for Donkey Kong Country. It was a French-Canadian production and ran for three seasons from 96 to 2000. 2000. It was actually revolutionary for its time, and it's said to be the first full-length CGI cartoon made with motion capture. So, you know, it looks dated. But um, there's usually a bunch of songs per episode. Usually, uh, the characters have their own song and break out into song randomly. Now, listen, I didn't really watch very much of this. I love Donkey Kong Country, but I didn't watch it. So, for me, maybe I've seen one or two episodes. But for me, this is going to be one of those things that's kind of like a nostalgia bomb, but at the same time, something unfamiliar. So, I don't know, someone sent this to me and it just seemed like a fun thing to do, so here it is. I'm not going to do more than say things when I watch it. It, it, it should be fine, Chad. It should be fine. Yeah, look at- Oh, did you see that? Hang on, Chad. Did you see that? I'm not going to be rewinding too much, but I need you to see that. Holy shit, Chad. He's sitting on a pier. And he was doing the finger of excitement. Was that, was that funky? Okay, having just done DKC3, and also um, the Bongo games, this felt like a necessary thing to check out at some point. This was so incredibly innovative for its time, but I guess just didn't appeal to me. I don't know why. I love Donkey Kong Country. Just decided not to watch it. Some people call me negative. They don't like my frown. Oh my god. They all try to cheer me up, but I'm down with being down. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. I kind of maybe like this voice better than Fred Armisen for Cranky. I'm so cranky. I got my finger on the feet. Yeah, I'm cranky. I'm cranky. For example, you come to see the most prized possession on the entire island. Who do you come to see? Me. Well, now that we got that straight, give your eyeballs a swing over there. It's a magical. It's mysterious. It's the eighth and a half wonder of the world. Someone said Nintendo can't take this down because they'd have to acknowledge it. Well, you're telling me they aren't as proud of this as they are the Mario movie from 93? A teleporter, a power supplier, and a wish fulfiller. In other words, whoever's got the coconut rules. Step right up and take a closer look. The crystal will explain The whole show is free on YouTube anyway. Okay. That's look at that, that physique. The strongest, brawniest, hippest ape in all of Congo Bongo. Our Congo Bongo. And future king got a lot of muscle mass, but uh, <laughs> not so much brain. Is that really what they call it? Congo Bongo? It's not DK Chill Island? Luck. How's the plan coming along? Is it done yet? <laughs> this is your finest hour. Oh my god. Oh my. Well, uh, why is there no head? Oh, okay. She does look real. 
Oh boy, we got the Germa raid during this. Uh, hi, thank you. What's your name? <gasps> My name is Candy. Happy to meet you. She's perfect. Put a head back on. You heard him, troops. Attack! For the record, we're not watching full episodes. We're just watching the songs of season one. Time to act unwise to this song again. King K. Rule is developing a new fetish as we speak. I'm sorry, I didn't need to say it out loud. You can see that clearly, that's what they were going for. Why are they? She lives, she lives, she could fool an idiot. Fool me. Now, snip, clip, power slip, you're a wimp and that's it. What is this voice for King K. Rule? Also, hi Raiders, thank you for joining. Um, we're just watching the songs from the DKC show from the 90s for some reason. So, hi, welcome. I've never seen any of this other than maybe a couple scattered assorted moments. It's a slightly gormless Kong. I'm gonna make a Donkey Kong Country movie, okay? Tarantino production. Again, this is apparently real motion capture. Very innovative show that we look back now and we're like, this looks like shit. Why doesn't Jimmy Neutron's dad shit into an oil drum? He's dead. Sorry, everyone. Permanent spine damage. Oh no. Everybody see what I can do. Cause it's Diddy to the rescue. Oh no, Diddy, what have they done to you? I can do most anything that Donkey Kong can do. Don't take too much to get me excited. Okay, in the text file here, it says the actor couldn't really sing in this voice. The supreme leader, the voice fits the character, but he cannot sing in the voice. Booty and the Beast. Chat, I'll let you know which song was my favorite by the end of the segment. And yes, I have the other seasons too, but we'll save those. It depends on how well this this segment goes. I was a young lad, my father said to me, Ireland, an ear and learn some pirate history. Oh my god. A fearsome pirate ruled the seven seas. He was your great, great, great grandpappy, Quince Kirby. He told me tall tales of his ill begun. This, this is the best one the yet. The greatest treasure of them all still haunts me to this day. I'll make you swap the deck and then I'll throw you in the break. I swear I'll make you walk the plank to right the wrong you did. The the day you check, can animations be uncanny? When the coconut is mine, then you'll feel his pirate sword. He hid it in an idol where it stayed for many years. But sliding around all over the place. To shed the crystal tear. It lay upon the ground until much to my surprise. Why nipples? I kind of feel like it would be weirder without them, no? No? Alright, never mind then. Why such a thick, outy belly button, though? Look, it's floating! Look at it, chat! It's floating! 
the belly button is floating. It's useless. I'm out of gas. I need bananas. <laughs> hey, yo! Yeah, you! Whoa. No! But what do you call these? Clap trap? No, ding dong. Bananas! Can you chomp us out of here? Uh-uh. Naga, no how. I guess that's Donkey Kong's voice. Is it better what than Seth Rogen? If you wouldn't mind just like handing us some bananas, that would be amazing. I mean, I like can you smoke the them? Pirate ship. I am a boat filled with gold and so hip. Scurvy took my teeth because she's afraid of me. Oh. He knows I'll eat everything I see. I got a deal that you can't refuse. I got the key, something you can use. If you don't help me, then it looks like we're beat. Someone get my teeth back. <laughs> I gotta eat. Wait, I thought he said scurvy took his teeth. Like the disease? Is that a character in the show? Oh, that's the pirate croc. I thought he got scurvy. Chat, this is a fucking fever dream. You do realize if you didn't grow up with this, this is really fucking bizarre. Even if you did play Donkey Kong Country. Hey, Candy, what do you say? Huh? Is this the real candy or is this robot? Yeah, oh my hey, god. Take a good look. Bluster, what is that thing on your head? Bluster? It's the banana flip. The banana slammers have them. All us hairy apes wear them. So, will you go out with me now? I wouldn't go out with you even if that was your real hair. Look, Luster, I go out with the future ruler of Congo Bongo, Donkey Kong. I, I guess Donkey this upsets Kong, everybody. Donkey Kong, big deal. What makes him so special? The crystal coconut. Holy shit. A baseline. Make a sound. Get the crystal coconut and candy come around. Donkey Kong eat good enough. Anyone can see that the only ape for her in Congo Bongo is me. Look at Frankie sleeping hour after hour. When I get the coconut, I get the power. Everything I want <laughs> and everything I need. If I can it in front of me, satisfy Frankie's feet. Oh. This is all too easy. Feels like a dream. Possessing all the power will make Donkey Kong scream. Wait, that's all you have to do is get that and then you're powerful? Huh. It's the Triforce, but Donkey Kong? Say, Eddie, how about a deal? Five for the barrel, it's a bargain. It's a steal. Steal? No, but here's the catch. Give us the barrel and we'll give you a match. Matches give you fire and fire gives you light. Will the barrel keep you warm on a cold winter's night? Light? Right! There's more you can do. Like cook banana burgers on the barbecue. <laughs> barbecue? Fire burgers too. Can a barrel light the sky like fire? Oh, the Diddy too? singing so voice is just deal? wonderful, have isn't it? Deal, Eddie? Eddie, have we got a deal? Have we got a deal? Have we got a deal, Eddie? Eddie, have we got a deal? How do I get this thing to light? Gotta move it, gotta shake it, gotta scratch it just right. Ooh, toasty buns. Homer. Warm, bright, light. Eddie, say thank you. Dan Castellaneta is playing Eddie the, the Yeti, who just looks like a different Donkey Kong. Dude, mm. you off in the White Mountains. Hang on. There he is. There's no bananas there, is there, Funky? There's nothing there, man. 
Funky's plane rides. Time to crash into a mountain. It's a different actor. It's not Dan Freddy. It sounded just like Homer. PBS Broadcasting. Oh, wow. What a voice. Did they need to go this hard for a kid's show? What a what a great voice. And that was actually a good song. And I feel bad for Donkey Kong now. Can I get a big smooch from a big dude? Oh, you mean me? I thought she was going to say, sure. from the big douche. Hey, cut it out. Bad timing, Cranky. Cruel is marching on. Okay, cruel? Okay, there's a lot to unpack here. Okay, so, okay, okay, okay. Cranky's dead. He's a force ghost. Diddy just got cock blocked. I On the barrel works, and you got to get over there. Why me? Because you're the... He's not dead. He's using the coconut. Oh. I kind of thought like you know that thing of of like when a relative dies they just watch you from the afterlife forever like that it's you know it's a trope it's like all your relatives are just watching you like do cool things on the internet and like be epic uh I thought that's what was happening here God, going from that Donkey Kong song to this whiplash. Diddy's VA was also Yoshi from the Super Mario World cartoon. Oh. That's right, your relatives are watching you watch my stream right now, so they're very proud of you. Not zero! Raiders of the Lost Banana. Yet again, Indiana Jones comes up on the stream tonight. What do you think of Induende Jones, chat? What do they do? You woke the sleeping idol of Inka Dinka do. We were in and we were out. Cool bada real bing, word. Boom. No big deal. Maybe, maybe not. You didn't touch anything? Nope. Mm -mm. Nothing. Then what's that? <laughs> oh, this. Uh, it's just a little something I picked up for candy. Uh -oh. It's starting. What is it? Encyclopedia Banana. <laughs> Is that what they're calling it? What's it say? Encyclopedia Bananica. Get the fuck out of here. See here, look what you've done now. You have brought the wrath of Inka Dinka do on down. How can such a pretty thing as this make things really go amiss? All I want is candy skins. It almost looks like words are coming out of his mouth. There's a curse. Put the banana back, but things are gonna get 
much worse. What's with all the worry? Can't you see I'm in a hurry? It's a perfect gift for our anniversary. The, the, the voice actor for Donkey Kong is way too good for this song. No bananas left for you to eat! No bananas? It's the curse of the golden banana. 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 I love every now and then their mouths just open in a very like weird way. Come on, Candy. I'll take you home. Like it's All right. Oh. Still my little love monkey. Oh, so weird. Oh god. You guys sure you have time for this? When I see a smile on your hairy face. Coconut cream pies? Don't say that. Oh my god, don't say that. Why are you saying that, chat? Take your place. I can't believe you feel the way that you do. Your love is like a dream come true. You are the sunlight warming up my day. Even K Rule likes it. Everything's okay. I see bananas when I Is that a Korok noise? Eyes. Chet, there's a Korok here. I shower you with coconut cream. Pie. What? No! You can't say that! Like so they knew! They knew! They knew! Love is stronger than a golden banana? Love is stronger than a golden banana. <laughs> he winked when he said it? Stronger than a golden banana. I swear I've never heard that before, chat member. I'm telling you, I've not heard this. I don't know how I haven't. I just haven't. Bye, bye. You had to. Uh, okay. Most famous song. I don't know. I just avoided it. <laughs> oh, cruel twist of fate. So young, so handsome, so brave. Why me? Why me? Why not somebody poor? And also, please it, understand I so that I have a terrible memory, home, and there is a chance that someone showed that to me like 10 years ago, and I just forgot money, it. Money? But I, as of this moment, I have no memory of that. Just saying. I have my reputation. Oh no, my reputation. Maybe unless, I blocked it. I change it, turn over a new leaf. One whole week. They knew. They knew. One whole week to become Lester the Benevolent. They invented a I bunch of new Kongs for the show, huh? As a straight up honest guy who will gladly give his life to save the average passerby. Where was this dude in the Super Mario movie? A statue in honor of me, a monument to symbolize my bravery. Bluster the benevolent, hailed as a king, blessing one and all instead of cursing everything. I would hand out daisies and rescue kittens from a tree and pick up all the litter that falls in front of me. Maybe they will name a city after me. Oh god. Do we really just need a singing head? Luster the benevolent, hailed as a god, spreading joy and love instead of bumbling like a clod. Luster the benevolent wins the Nobel Prize for bringing world peace about in the blink of an eye. I really don't like this guy, chat. And I've I've hated some Kongs before. 
but never Wrinkly Kong. I could never hate her. Did they they didn't <laughs> they didn't really settle on the pronunciation, did they? It's great to be a king. I seem to have a knack for taking everything I want and giving nothing back. Oh shit. Take away your jellies. He's got like a Hank Hill ass. Have a nice vacation when I take your travel plan. Nothing on this earth can stop me now. Everything is mine. Chat, some of those 3D models aren't moving. Uh, excuse me. I heard they might be JPEGs. You all look I'll like I know what a JPEG is. If you please. And I'll put an end to this silly world peace. Fools, while I watch you cower, this my finest hour Bait you on my hook Just like a worm Before I crush you like a bug Come over here And give me a hug It gives me so much joy To watch you squirm Stop right oh, there, this What is this? Guess we'll never find out. Uh, <laughs> this is gonna just come across as a big advertisement for the show. People are gonna have to look this up now. Apparently, it's all on YouTube, so you know, have fun. Oh, with a message inside. A message from some flounder? <laughs> Not a message. It's a map. That's no ordinary map. Look, look, foot Those graphics. To a big X. So. Who wants to go clear across the island for an X? Especially when all you can spell with it is like uh, Why are Funky's glasses like morphing? Or, ox or treasure? <laughs> There's no X in treasure, did he? Oh, I know that. It's like Spider-Man eyes. Oh. They're his flesh? The spot. Treasure theme. Fortune. I can't go. Huh? Got a date with Candy. What are these noises? How could you pass on something like this? I wanna go when it's all that you wish for. Think of all the trouble you're gonna miss. Don't you wanna get your hands on riches galore? No, just don't stop. Just stop. No. Get your head out of the clouds. Adventures waiting, time's a waste. You could be living on easy shit. They didn't say bitches galore. You could have a home they said coconut, coconut cream pie, pie not bitches galore. For two you could have your own banana tree. You could buy anything you want for candy. TK, Fortune. I can't go. Huh? I've got a date with candy. Chat, I need to hear if it said bitches galore. I don't think it did. Riches galore. Riches. I don't know what he said anymore, chat. I, I don't know what he said anymore. I, I give up. The show is very confusing. DK said it was time to make like a banana and split. Dig. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a klutz when it comes to doomsday devices. And By the time he puts a cork in, it will be the new owners of the Congo Bongo Barrel Works! Meme scene? With these riches, I will gain my freedom From cluster acting <laughs> like a jerk I don't need anyone to shower me with diamonds I won't ever have to work But to pass my dear, the treasure is 
is mine now. I can plan my evil schemes. With this device, I will take over the island. Oh, it sounds like such a dream. I don't mean to disappoint you, boo. I'm gonna stop you from your evil ways. Conga Bongo will be out of your grasp. And the island Please don't sing, Diddy. One more day. Oh my goodness, oh my gosh, I don't like this. Someone take away this doomsday thing. I have to think about myself and save my own skin. Who knows what evil this will bring? This is a nice song. It's just after DK sings, I don't want anyone else to sing. I feel like it was this show just like a subtle way to get people to buy the CD of the show because the songs are so catchy. Well, not all of them. There it is. What? There's what? There's what is. Which one, chat? That one? Or that one? Or that one? Or that one? Okay. Got it. Thank you. Frankie's Tickle Tonic? I don't want any of that. This episode was banned in Australia. Confirmed. Coconut. Problem. Frankie once gave me a mega vitamin drink. Maybe we can find his recipe. Oh, I don't know, little buddy. Don't worry, DK. Everything's under control. Hey, see if there's a recipe in that book. But we promised Cranky we... No problem. It's the cookbook. Go on, look for a recipe. Okay, little buddy. Uh, uh, here. Say one banana and zing zang zo. Then say coconut, and it should float. Diddy, we need to cook. No, no, DK, that's not it. That's not the right formula. Saul say got the law off of us. And zing, zang, zoat. Then say coconut, and it should float. <laughs> go, Diddy, go! A dash of zing adds a bit of ping. A cup of zang gives it some tang. A little bit of that and a whole lot of this. I mean, there's a lot of genres being covered here, guess. chat. The crystal coconut is what? 98.95% pure? Shit. I can't believe Donkey Kong is Walter White. This is so much fun. I can't wait till it's done. It's gonna taste great. Hang on. You wait. Is it ready to try? I'm so excited. I can die. I'm to waste. Say one banana and say Chad, I rewound. I, I saw a good face. I want to pause on the good face. When the recipe tastes okay, and you're mixing your cares away. So go ahead and take your screenshots. We now have DK Pog. Uh, if anyone wants to throw this into an emote, I will add it to the channel. Thank you. All right, let's continue. It's gonna taste great. Just you wait. Is it ready to try? I'm so excited I could die. A little more zing is just the thing. Oh, yeah. Say one banana. And Donkey say Pog. Zing, zing, zing. <laughs> Amazing. And remember, this is all season okay, one. Donkey Kong, you've got your peace and quiet. Now what? We got like I another eighteen minutes of this, Daddy. and then we'll we'll do season two and three eventually. I think. 
Hundred banana bunches on the wall. Hundred banana bunches. If one of the bunches should happen to bruise, nine nine banana bunches on the wall. But jizz on the wall. You that for me? Yep. What? It, what? You're prettier than a barrel full of bananas, Candy. And there's more. A lot more. Ninety-eight banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-eight banana bunches. If one of the oh, bunches, bunches. to bruise, ninety-seven banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-seven banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-seven banana bunches. If one of the is bunches Candy like to bruise, ninety-six banana bunches on the wall. Uncannily walking like diagonal. If one of the bunches should happen to bruise, ninety-five banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-five banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-five banana bunches. If one of the bunches should happen to bruise, ninety-five banana bunches on the wall. Ninety-five banana bunches on the wall. I should have guessed you were behind. This the fuck is this scene? No! Bluster! And you back to work! If one of the bunches should happen to bruise, 92 banana bunches on the wall, 92 banana bunches on Man, I hope the voice actor got paid well for this. Good. Sound like a Jinjo. I had you all wrong, Donkey Kong. You are indeed a champ among chimps. <laughs> Imagine joining to see that with no context. Like me From right now, actually. Forth, I, Bluster Kong, do hereby solemnly swear an oath of allegiance to do all within my power to you got a good you from throat, personal boy. injury as long as I shall live. Well, it's obvious, General Trump, isn't it? One ape is a pain, two apes is a conspiracy, a scheme, a plot. My and apes, know who he's up for sale, no. Uh, please, me. oh Dave, wow, good, good job, that was very fast. Me, me, me. Oh. David Gilmore on guitar over here. Everyone is plotting against me. They're muttering it's like Enter Sandman me. Floyd. Scam. Donkey Kong and Bluster working together. How or maybe more Santana, like Chad's saying, yeah. No one's going to make a oh. Oh. out of me. No one gets this diabolical sipping tea. I'm a rightful ruler. Anyone can see No one oh, can fuck. make A monkey out of me They must be building A top secret weapon Mounting an army As fast as they can Chat, this is pretty Another fucking good two impudent apes. What Someone just said the song is ass Alright, never mind I on counterintelligence after all what kind of intelligence do apes have with brains you just have to ignore the, the vocals that's no all donkey pog is now live thank you elizarin and thank you dave as well Shit's catchy though. Donkey I could learn a lot from the monkey show. Hepped up high on this do or die hero jag. He's driving me crazy, funky. Here, uh, I hate to say it, I'm hearing some jar jar going on then over here. Fasten your surf belt, citizen, and catch this wave. Good thing we get to see his backside while he's doing this dance. Like an alpha zone out. Corpacetic glide by, leaving you with no doubt. No need to wig. You think it's a hardcore full tilt chillable gig. Do that monkey like that monkey do you. Imagine going back to Roman times and showing them this on a palm pilot. <laughs> if you want to get a monkey know. off of your back, <laughs> let him save your life and you'll be even. It's as simple as that. 
You'd be crucified? Well, at least you'd be fucking cool. Oop, that monkey like the monkey do you. If you want to get a monkey off your back, let him save your life and you'll be even. It's as simple as that. I like the use of the word copacetic. Orangatango. I think we know what kind of music we're going to get here, chat. Funky, the way you and Candy look on the dance floor. Oh, I wish I could dance like you. Uh, anyone can make the moves, Donkey Dude. Come on, I, give it. us another try. Just had a perfect Candy angle on, 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 on Funky Kong. To have some rhythm just to make the scene, just feel the beat. Hear it in your head, moving to your middle, ending at your feet. Anyone can dance, anyone can do it. Follow my like, lead, cause look at those uh, sandals going through the ground. Swiveling free, it's the balance in your hips that's key. Take your arms, wave them in the air. Keep yourself from falling, and you'll glide without a care. Anyone can dance. Why's Dan Diddy look so worried? It. Follow my lead, cause there ain't nothing to it. You're gonna need style and personality to give you individual. Don't be afraid to move the way I want to move. Trust your chat. This kind of reminds me of whose line is it anyway? Anyone can dance, anyone can do it. Follow my lead, cause there ain't nothing to it. <laughs> it's like Wayne is just improv right now. Anyone can do it. Follow my And Colin and Ryan are just dancing. <laughs> oh, okay. We got a seizure warning. It's very kind of whoever edited this. On a stick. <laughs> be aware of that, chat members. <laughs> if you want, I can put an image on the screen. Are you thinking what I'll I'm just thinking? put some Watto cups up if needed. Okay, it's over. I win. You lose everything, including your dignity. <laughs> what? <laughs> Hang loose and do it like in the temple, dude. Go, DK, go! <laughs> if I had a nickel for every time there was a dance to solve the problems episode or movie, then I'd be rich. Oh, nice harmony. Yes! Yeah. Take your arms, wave them in the air. Keep yourself from falling and you'll glide without a care. Anyone oh, I see. It. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to bring up the Watto Cup fast enough. Sorry, chat. Shit, I was gonna do a Watto solo. Clump! Based on audience response, the winner of the Rango Tango Dance Contest is. 
<laughs> Where are these photos? Th these photos even being taken from? He didn't win that. Tell Candy you'd rather be with me. Well, I. Uh, tell him, Donkey Kong. Tell Diddy you'd much rather be with me. Well, uh, well uh, why does he have to choose? Quit your blabbering, Donkey Kong. I want that miserable bug of yours in my cabin yesterday. Now move it, quick. Donkey Kong, I'm watching you! Gotta go! You know how cranky cranky gets when you are uh, keeping me with a uh, waiting. Monkey He's movies with me. So. My man's gonna eat like a beast. Cause I prepared a banana feast. Yeah. I'm gonna treat him like the king he is. Huh, we'll see about that. Fuck, we'll you see about that. To understand. Get it through your head if you can. Didn't you see the look in his eyes? Girl, it's time for you to get wise. That's why he'd rather be with Unwise. Me. Oh my god. Be with me. That's why he'd rather be with me. Ha, see what I mean? <laughs> That's why he'd rather be with me. With you? Yeah, me. We'll see. That's why he'd rather be with me. <laughs> hmm. So you see, Cranky, it's all set up. All you gotta do is push the rocket delivery button. She had varicose veins on her chest. Oh, that's that's nice. That makes two of us. <gasps> Using the crystal. Diddy, push the big red button. I was just trying to charge my crystals, Cranky. You can be Whoa, it's like a new wave song. You there anywhere you can go, any place you wanna go, don't you know? You're just an image of yourself floating in the air. Like craft worky talking heads, Gary Newman. More Gary Newman. This fucking guy's voice is amazing. A telegram! Oh wow. I've never attempted a Gilbert Gottfried impression, but oh wait, I have. Never mind. Your own personal Jesus! Okay, we're almost done. We got three minutes and fifty seconds Ooh, left. I'm shooting it is, cause you read the letter. Worst of it is, it's a double curse. If it's read once more, the crystal coconut goes out. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how much more of this I can handle in one sitting, chat. To the bottom of the ocean, just like Bluebeard Baboon ship did one thousand years ago. If we got letters, there's a good chance every ape on the island got letters, too. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dixie. And Funky and Bluster. My favorite is in season two, so hopefully one day. Maybe. 
there will be no Congo bongo and no bananas too. Who knows how many got this note and understood its power? To anyone who reads it twice, this could be our darkest hour. <sighs> the trepid dab up, blabu, curse it, double dabu up, dooby doo. No, you say it wrong. Bluebeard baboons, curse of the double dabu. We're making up words again. The secret of the double curse lies in the words you see. You read them once, then read them twice, then we'll all be history. There's danger in the jungle, and it's causing a commotion. The island that we know and love will sink into the ocean. It's a treadle, double, fearful, cursing, double wahoo of blue suede shoe. Uh-huh. The curse of the double the blues. The curse of the double the blues. Donkey Kong. With Bluebeard's curse, things go bad to worse. It looks like we're all doomed. Let's go, little buddy. I'm with you, DK. <laughs> While you try and get the new voice unlocked. I'll see if Great Aunt Grouchy has any suggestions. Well. Someone just said, I just noticed D.I. is naked. Who is D.I.? <laughs> They're all naked. Honestly, it's rarer that they have on any, like, pants or clothing. K. Rule has a cape, and that's it. DK has a tie. Oh, well, thank God his cock is covered. Shrink them down to yeah. size, and then I'll swap them all like flies. Donkey Kong will pile my claws, I'll make him oil my feet. I'll turn bananas into cheese. Spin in the distance there. Freeze cranky's hologram, and then I'll stop. See, I was generous enough to give you a spin. I'll use him give you some food. Acknowledge the feet? No. I'll have him oil my feet. Yeah, that's just like generic evil guy thing. It's like a Soundgarden riff. Well, Sabbath. No, it's like, um, you know, like a king has their feet oiled and washed and stuff. I don't know. Uh, it's fine, chat. It's it's not normal or weird. Something like that. Well, that is episodes 1 to 13 of the Donkey Kong Country television program. And it is absolutely fucking bizarre. And it's way too much in one go, because now my brain hurts. Uh, the coconut cream pie was amazing. And I can't believe I just said that. Please don't take that out of context. And the animations at times were pretty amazing as well. Mostly, you just kind of get used to it. And I guess if you're living in the 90s like I was, I just didn't watch the show in the 90s. But I think I would have been like, wow, those are amazing. But the songs were genuinely pretty good. Some of them way better than others. And DK's voice actor is incredible. So... The one where DK said he's not a hero, it, that's that was my favorite song. That was really good singing, good melody, just got a, had a great like feel to it. So yeah, I mean, I'm glad I finally got a chance to see these songs. If I had, I didn't remember them, so they were new to me at least for for the time being. But uh, thank you for sharing this with me, chat. This was fun. And uh, if it's something you'd like to continue, we can continue in a future segment. I have season two and three edited in the same way, but for now, we are going to take a quick break. I'm going to play a song as if we didn't just hear enough music, but I'm going to play a song and then we'll play Getting Weird With It. And the first game I'm going to be playing in Getting Weird With It is Yoshi Goes to Tesco. Just to give you an example, it's going to be 
Well, it's going to be weird. Be right back. <laughs> 